Hey, what's up, gamers? Enforcer5150 here, and we're back to play Fallout 4. Um, I don't know how much more Fallout 6 we're going to do because that was not going too well. Um, if we put out the last one, this, you know, it's probably the last one for a while until I can kind of think of any reason to play it. <laughs> I just, I didn't have that much fun with it, and I wasn't, uh, wasn't really getting into it. Maybe I'll play it a little bit more and then uh, record again at a later date. But for now, I don't think we're going to do that. So we're going to play more Fallout 4. Uh, everything is vanilla with um, the high texture quality on. I did install or uninstall the update and checked out some mods and stuff like that. But then you don't get the new stuff. And I was like, yeah, I'll just keep going with no mods and only the... Uh, you know, high textures on here, but yeah, we're gonna keep going. Hey, is that Morpheus? Morpheus, Morpheus, wake up, wake up. We're out of the matrix. Ah. <laughs> anyway, um, I think we're gonna continue on with our uh storylines or quest lines, I should say. Um, I think we have to find uh Virgil in the glowing sea, but I think we needed to talk to. What's his name again? I kind of want to uh, follow the story with uh, what's her name? Uh, the newspaper lady. I can't remember. But yeah, I think we're going to go ahead and get back to Diamond City and first do that. And then we'll continue on our game. All right. Back to Diamond City. Um, I don't know why I put the FPS up there. It doesn't go over 120 because I have to cap at 120 or else everything uh, starts going a little bit fast or faster than normal um i did try to install some of the mods from the creation and none of them were working okay let's see i i know we have a quest here yeah see we have this one but it didn't say which one it is let's see i think it is the one that i want um I was going to look through here real quick. Oh, story of the century. That has to be her. Yeah, okay. Let's see. Let's, let's see what Piper has to do for us. Before we go on with the, uh, the quest with uh, Nick and everything. Cause she had a lot of stuff that uh, she was talking about. Oh. I'll go. constantly trying to kill us. Oh, I can't hear you. Oh, I need to change my settings. Um, all right, now I should have the subtitles on and everything, and issue. just you wait. Should be a wait. I was gonna say, who is that, Nat? Who are you? All right. Hey, Piper. Hey, hey Piper. All right. Um. Oh, travel with me. I thought she had a actual quest. Oh, let's sure. go. Let's go. Will do. There we go. I kind of want to see what her thing goes. Oh, she's got a nice gun. She's got one like mine, or like my other one, my nine mil. All right, so where are we supposed to hey, go? Just let me know. All right, talk. Piper. You holding up, Blue? What are we? What are we supposed to do? I woke up, and the world still sucks. So today's been great. Interesting, you mentioning that. There we go. Because you're from a vault. Yeah. You're not wearing the blue jumpsuit right now, but the pit boy and that fish out of water look? Dead giveaways. So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. Besides, I'm already following you around. <laughs> Might as well get some quotes while we're at it. <laughs> well, you just literally just followed me around for like a little bit. All right. Uh, what's involved? What I want to kind of see what we're getting ourselves into. Are, get your opinion on life out there and maybe load up a few tough questions and keep it interesting. What do you say? Ooh, this could get kind of dirty because everything I have to say has to do with the Institute, which does not want to be uh, talked about. So let's do All this. Right, Piper. Let's, let's talk about it. Good. Let's get down to business. So I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? Uh, I w what? I, were, I was frozen. My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. Wait. <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? 
Yep. The whole time? Sure Are enough. Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yes, I was. Wait, oh yeah, I was asked, what's the war? The war? Which war? The one that gave us this lovely landscape of demolished buildings and nuclear radiation every ten feet? You're telling me you saw everything before they blasted it into pieces? Yes. Yes. I'm over 200 years old. <laughs> oh my god. The man out of time. There you go. So, the man you've out of seen time. The Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Ah. Gives me hope. Fun destroying things. It sucks. Oh, what's that? She's probably not going to like this, but I'm going to say how do you what do you how do you think? Can you even compare the two? The world out here? It's not even close to the one I left. Feeling a little homesick, are we? Can't say I blame you. For the last part of our interview, I'd last like part? to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Uh, get revenge. <laughs> um, one day at a time, don't lose hope. Let's just be positive. Don't lose hope. No matter how much you want to give up, don't. You have to have hope that you'll see them again. Or at least that you'll know the truth. A strong note to end on, Blue. Thanks. That's everything. It's going to take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway, we should probably get going. Thanks again. That was like barely any of my story. <laughs> so, I don't know. Anything I can do? No, you, you just say the word. You're almost as useless as Valentine. But anyway, um <laughs> Let's see here. I guess we're going to have to find go to the glowing sea, but we actually need a uh a cell before we go there. Um, because we're gonna need power armor or a lot of uh, D rads, rad X. Uh, let's see, instigate. We can insta uh, investigate the Brotherhood of Steel airship. You can see where is that on the map? Let's see. Oh my God, we were literally right there. We can probably, yeah, we can actually fast travel there. Um, you know what? I gonna. I think I want to find. Um, what's the name? Because the Brotherhood of Steel does not like uh, synths. So I should really take Valentine with me. <laughs> Big, loud, corrupt officials and brown nosing citizens. Uh, hi. All right. Where is Valentine? Let's go find Valentine, and we're gonna take him with us. Hey, Valentine. Good to be back in Diamond City. Yeah, I'm gonna take Nick, you out of here. Time to hit the road. Yep, sure is. Let's head out. Let's head out. Well, all right. So, any stories you two come across out there? I get the exclusive, right? Sure. Piper, I wouldn't know who else to tell. Send Piper to Red Rocket Truck Stop. Um, I guess. He's <laughs> not the type to turn someone away, but he's only one person. <laughs> so sometimes things just pile up. And I'm all ready to go. That Valentine's all ready to get moving. All right, let's get moving. Okay, so we got uh, Valentine with us. We're gonna go ahead and fast travel to here, and then go south, investigate the Brotherhood of Steel airship. I think that's what we need to do. All right, back to where we almost got ourselves killed once. I don't know. I think actually uh, Shalano uh, had to cut some of this out because when I was going up to investigate up here, I came down this way and I was like, oh man, I went the wrong freaking way. So maybe it wasn't in that video. I'm not sure. I, I wanted to see what would happen if we brought uh, Valentine with us because... The Brotherhood of Steel does not like synths. So what happens if you take Valentine to the Brotherhood of Steel? Huh. 
Alright. Dude with some power armor. Alright. The airport, huh? You sure you want to waltz through Brotherhood HQ with a synth at your side? <laughs> yes, I do. Well, good Abomination. You too. Well, good afternoon to you too. Uh, <clears throat> this area is off limits to civilians. I order you to stand down and tell me what you're doing here immediately. All right. Airship. I was hoping to track down the owners of that huge airship. Well, you found us. Since this is a military installation, this is the closest you're going to get to her. I'm ex-military. I understand. I'm ex-military myself. Really? Well then, you might just be in luck. Ah, there you go. You might actually fit in with the Brotherhood. We're always looking to add a few more brothers and sisters to our ranks. Well, he changes too real quick. You have what it takes. Um... I know I do. Will it get me up in there? What's he say? I know I do. I know I have what it takes. Then prove it to us. All right. Go over to the Cambridge Police Station and look for Paladin Dance. He's in charge of our new recruits, and I'm certain he'll be glad to have an extra gun on his team. Ad Victorium, civilian, and good luck. Ad Victorium. Okay. So we need to go to the police station and talk to this recruiting guy. All right, uh, where is the police station? Way over here. Oh, well, we were actually not, I think we went right by there. I think we came down this way before. So, let's go to the labs and head up there. All right, here we are. So can someone just explain to me why I enjoy Fallout 4 so much better than Fallout 76? Like I am, I mean, it's kind of the same game in a lot of ways. But my only thoughts is that it just seems disconnected, if if that makes any sense. Like it doesn't doesn't seem like it has everything that Fallout 4 had, or you know, has. Because when I play Fallout 76, I'm just I guess feel like you know we're just running from one spot to another, just doing whatever. Oh, ooh, got lunchbox. Ha ha ha. Uh, we'll take that bottle. A collection or something? Yes, I am. Um, leave me alone. You just shot it. <laughs> but yeah, when I'm playing Fallout 76, it just doesn't seem like there is a lot to do. And everything seems very bare and empty. Um, uh, basically, when I'm going from place to place, I don't feel like I'm in any type of danger. It just seems like I'm just running through, you know? Okay, we need to go... Pretty much right where that those shots are coming from. What we got going on over here? Rivel. Ah. Okay, well that's the dude we need. Oh, he got knocked out. Whoa, whoa behind me. Okay. See, I'm not even on, like, the hardest level. And there is... Danger. There's actual danger here. Like, I, I'm pretty sure I could die any minute. Yeah. Ooh, what the heck? Okay, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run! Go, 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 go! Oh! Alright, I need a stem, I need a stem, I need a stem. Alright, um... Let's see... Let's get... Stems? Do we have any stems? Yep, we got a few. And... Eat a little bit of roach meat. Alright. Let the health build up. Come on, one of those shots has hit him in the head. A two. Move up here. Woohoo! All right. All right. Let's get um. 
Well, I guess we do one more stem. Well, we don't really need to do stems. We can do some of the other things. We got pure oh purified water. Perfect. All right. Um, weapons. The ten is not doing it. Oh well, that's actually fine. Thirteen. And yeah, we don't have a lot of ammo for everything else. There we go. I was like worried I was gonna take a bit and I was gonna end up dying. A ladle. <laughs> Bottle caps. I like that. Toy rocket trip. Alright, let's get our loots. Alright. Alright, Paladin Dance. What is up? Excuse me. We appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business here? Everything's my business. My business. I prefer to keep my business to myself. Then, if there's nothing left to discuss, oh. <laughs> I suggest you leave our compound immediately. Probably not the best thing to say. Oh, wait, okay, 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 come on. Wait, 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 guy, come on, come on. Paladin Dance. Have you decided to cooperate and tell me what brought you here? Yeah, yeah. All right, who are you? Before I answer, will you tell me who you are? In due time. If you want to remain in our compound, I suggest you answer my question first. Okay, fine. Let's talk about a joining up. A soldier pointed me this way. I might be interested in joining up. Interested in recruitment, huh? Well, let me ask you a few questions. Are you from a local settlement? Mm, no, we'll say, we'll say Vault 111. I'm from Vault 111. You're a vault dweller? Most people <laughs> admit to such a thing. I appreciate your honesty. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Okay. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. All right. Who are you really? I want to help, but I don't like the secrecy. Who are you really? Out with it. Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. I've been trying to send a distress call to our vessel at Boston International Airport, but the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, if I may. Proceed, Halen. I've modified Halen? the radio tower on the roof of the police station. But I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need. The deep range transmitter. We Sounds like a facility, job for me. Secure the transmitter and bring it back here. So what do you say? You willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? Yes. Wait, should I say Brotherhood of Steel? Yeah, I'm going to say that first. The Brotherhood of Steel. Let's Our ask order questions. to understand the nature of technology. It's power. It's meaning to us as humans, and we fight to secure that power from those who would abuse it. Uh, noble cause. Yeah, your cause seems noble. I'm pleased say that. to agree. Oh, I please you, do I? Outside the Brotherhood, who appreciate the gravity of the situation we're facing as a species. So, what do you say? Will you help us? I suppose. Time to waste. Let's get moving. Outstanding. All right, you leveled up. Pick up a new perk. There we go. Right. Halen, take Reese inside and find his wounds. Yes, sir. Reese, once you're on your feet, I want you to make certain the perimeter is secure. I'm on it. All right, civilian. It's time to prove your worth. Head into the police station and resupply yourself. Then let me know when you're ready to begin. Let's move out. Nice. All Only right, opens with a key. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Hey, let me in. All right, call the arms. What the heck, dude? Oh, Bethesda. <laughs> you gonna try to sit in a chair next? All right, it says I need to talk to him, but it says to resupply in here, which we can finally get some stuff. Nothing good in here. We don't need to find something in here because that may take a while. <laughs> right. Little squirrel bits. All right. Well, I'm not gonna do all this on camera or anything, but I think now that we're here, I think what we're gonna do is uh, cut this into more than one part um, because I'm pretty sure after this we're gonna have to go and help with that tower, and it'll be you know a whole another thing that we need to do. But yeah, I I very much enjoy this game over Fallout 76. Unfortunately, I really want to put on my uh, mods and stuff like that. You know, just visual mods and all those you know 
visual details, cosmetic. Um, but then I lose um, some of the uh, new things that came in, like the quest lines and stuff like that, which I do want to uh, have in here and to stay in here. I think uh, because I uninstalled it and reinstalled it, I might have to go back and do it all again. Like, <laughs> just the, the main thing. I need to do Echoes of the Past, but yeah, I think we'll have to just do that all over when we hit a higher level. Anyway, that's all we're going to do for this video today. Make sure you hit that like button, definitely subscribe if you're Sorry new to the channel. You all take care and happy gaming.